Hello world, it's been uh, far too long since I last updated the vlog. Um, if you've been reading my blog, www.ljofa.wordpress.com, um, you'll know the reason why. Uh, I've kind of uh, been lost. I uh, haven't found my place um, since the holiday. Things have changed and I just... It's difficult to know where one is. Um, in regard to life, I guess. What that means, I have no idea. Uh, two months later and I still don't have the faintest idea on what I want going forward uh, in the new decade of life, work, friends, love life, all of that. Everything is very much um, like... Uh, cup of coffee where you've just poured in the milk and you're stirring it really really fast and everything's just blending together eventually it'll stop spinning and i'll know where i am but until then utter confusion anyway i've recorded two videos um one from when i got back off of holiday which i want to show you first and then one i recorded earlier today here in brussels so let's uh, fade out and fade in I'm back, I'm tanned, slightly in the face as you can see, uh, and today this is uh, dry and sunny apparently. Uh, we just had a hailstorm, not as bad as the one in Malta, but uh, still quite um, exciting, shall we say. Especially to see a bunch of people running around like headless chickens uh, in the uh, freezing cold ice storm. Uh, which I was nicely out of the way of because I was in Nero. Uh, so yeah, a real proper English homecoming. Uh, I think. Uh, just been to the retro game fair, retro game market rather, at the Royal National Hotel on uh, stupid Guinness Hat Day today, or St. Patrick's if you prefer the PC version. Um, bought some art, bought a book, and finally got hold of a new copy of Silent Hill on the PS1 which now I have to try and remember where I put my PS1 but yeah one of my favorite games and I'm glad I managed to get a, a, a copy for well I was stung for 30 pounds but uh, other jokers storeholders whatever you want to call them uh, were asking 50 quid for a copy of Silent Hill on the PS1 um, not paying that uh, so yeah now is the uh, now is the unenviable task of, uh, well, rejoining my life, basically. But um, I think rejoining my life with lessons learned from the holiday, what I've learned about myself, what I've taken from some of the people I've met, and, uh, yeah, sorting out some of the detritus, um, cleaning that away. Because as I've been, I was telling people a few weeks ago, you know, no major life changes, no major life decisions until after I come back. Well, now I'm back, I can't use that as an excuse anymore. So, uh, watch this space, I guess, see what, what changes are, are forthcoming. Um, I guess I'm gonna continue this video blog for now uh, until I get bored of it, or um, I get too much abuse from, uh, well, most likely friends and family members rather than random strangers. Um, Oh, bloody noisy. Um, I've forgotten how loud traffic can be after the rain. Uh, but yeah, I'm not going to give it up just yet. I think there's still some mileage to go. And maybe it's an excuse to learn some new life skills, video editing and, and stuff. So these things can look a bit more professional and I can hold the gaze of the camera for more than 10 seconds at a time. Because uh, it's really weird talking into a phone, particularly in public. People look as you you're weird but uh, hey oh they've been doing that for the last 40 years and three weeks so why stop now anyway uh, crossing the road lots of scary looking cyclists uh, uh, wanting to snatch the phone out of my hand so yeah I will bid you adieu and um, keep watching bonjour à Bruxelles uh, it's a lovely sunny Tuesday afternoon here in Brussels uh, my first trip out of the UK since the holiday Although not my first trip out of London, that was Swansea last week and that was a bit grim because the weather was uh, definitely not on my side. Very, uh, very South Wales. 
Uh, so here for work and gone into town at the normal time of um, four something o'clock um, and just having a slow walk to the hotel via the back streets so I can record this without everybody stopping, staring and uh, otherwise pointing or trying to swipe my mobile up my hand. Not that crime is a massive problem in Brussels or at least not to my knowledge but uh, better late than or better safe than sorry. Anyway, he said looking suspiciously around. Uh, yeah, not much to do today or in the next uh, 24 hours other than attend the uh, the meeting that I need to go to and hold up a placard about something road safety related. I've no idea what I'm going to write on it, but um, I dare say I'll think of something. Uh, my first instincts were something quite political, but then I don't really want to be sacked, at least not yet. Um, but uh, it'll, I'm sure it'll make mainstream uh, media because it's, it, it's a big photo opportunity for the, um, for the next decade of road safety. So I'm gonna cut this uh, off in a minute um, so I can, find something to drink I am gasping for a coffee they only serve like um, thimble sized cups on Eurostar these days what's the point of that and um, ugh, I need some sort of an infusion to keep me going for the rest of the afternoon so I'll bid you adieu for now and probably check in with you later bye